Hey, what's up guys? Spencer Rhodes here. So, in The Walking Dead Season 10, Episode 8, a bunch of characters get trapped in a cave. Daryl, Carol, Jerry, Magna, Connie, Kelly, Aaron, and it's pretty much Carol's fault. Carol had lured them into this trap because she chased after Alpha, so it's pretty much Carol's fault. And in Episode 9, they are trying to get out of the cave, and they all manage to get out of it, except for Connie and Magna. And... It seems like Connie and Magna are possibly dead. A lot of fans have been debating about this. Are they dead? Are they alive? Are one of them dead? Are they going to be revealed to be alive later for some dramatic plot twist? And I've been sort of struggling with it because we didn't we don't see them die in episode 9. And then in episode 10, we don't really get much information one way or the other if they're alive or not. Daryl just kind of goes after Alpha and has that big fight scene with her. But the interesting thing is, in the preview for episode 11, we see Daryl c continuing to look for Magna and Connie. He was doing it at the end of episode 9. He was setting out to look for them. So Daryl's still looking for them because Daryl hasn't given up hope that they might still be alive. I mean, he has romantic feelings for Connie, so I don't think he's going to give up. And yeah, there, there's a decent chance that they're, that they're alive at this point, both of them, one of them. In the in the trailers, we see Yumiko, Kelly, Luke. They're they're worried about Connie and Magna because you know those are their they they were like a family, a family of five people, and that's two people in their family. And Yumiko's asking so, something like, "Have you had any luck finding them?" And Luke says, "We need to find our people." So it seems like they're really trying to make it seem like they're just missing. They're not dead. They're missing. The, the, these characters are looking for them. Like, they they could just be t taken somewhere, or captured somewhere, or, or trapped somewhere. Like, they're not dead, they're missing. So, I, I don't know. I'm starting to feel like Connie and Magna are alive. I mean, if they were going to die, why didn't they just kill them in Episode Nine? Why didn't they just, just show their deaths? Like, what's the point of all this playing around if they're just going to die anyway? Like, is it going to be like Sophia Walker in the barn? Where you, you don't know if she's dead or not, and then it, she actually is dead? Or is it going to be, you don't know, and then they're alive? I mean, I, I, at this point, I feel like Connie and Magna are good. I I, I was really struggling. For, I mean, there, there's definitely a little while where I was leaning towards at least a 50-50 chance. Um, definitely thought that them being dead was a possibility because Connie was such a likable character and, and really innocent, and she kind of reminded me, she, uh, she kind of gave me those those Beth Tyrese vibes, those like Glenn vibes, you know, I was kind of, I was kind of worried about her dying. I was kind of worried that they'd kill her off and then they'd use that to develop Kelly, which they're, they're kind of doing, but maybe they're not really killing her off. So yeah, I, I thought that maybe they could die because maybe it would, it would just really be a, a sad, devastating blow to, to Daryl and Carol, Carol realizing that it's her fault it would really add some emotional weight to the the fact that she got them trapped in that cave and everything. But it's starting to seem like they're alive. I'm starting to feel differently. I'm starting to feel like they're both alive. Plus, apparently a few days ago, Angela King did an interview where she explains that the actress that played that plays Connie is doing the Eternals for Marvel, and that's a part of why she got ridden out. So literally... Angela King is trying to work with Connie's actress schedule with the Eternals. So maybe that's why this happened. So they're specifically making Connie and Magna missing be because of that, possibly. So that that must mean that they have serious plans for those characters because wh why not just just straight up kill them off? You know, why why make it difficult? They're not just killing them off. They're they're having it be a mystery and everything. So and I, and I've said over and over again that I felt like both Connie and Magna had more potential. They they seemed like th th they weren't developed all the way. So I, I, yeah, I'm I'm hoping that they're alive. I'm I'm starting to feel like they're alive. If if they were dead, why didn't we just see them die in episode 9, you know? So I'm starting to feel like that they're alive. I'm starting to feel like there's a 90% chance that both of them are alive. And I say both of them because I mean, yeah, they can do it where Connie's dead, Magna's alive, Magna's dead, Connie alive, but Connie's alive. But I feel like they they, sh they should have the same fate. They're going to have the same fate. They're either both dead or they're both alive. 
And I'd say there's like a 90, 95% chance they're both alive at this point. So I think Connie and Magna are alive. We might have to wait a few episodes to see them again. Hopefully we don't wait all the way up, up until season 11 because that's a super long freaking time. I don't want these characters to be like Beth where we have to wait forever. So hopefully we'll see them again in the next few episodes. But I do believe at this point right now that Connie and Magna are in fact still alive and we will see them again. So yeah, but maybe they're captured somewhere or something. I don't know, but they're alive in my opinion, and they'll most likely be seen again before season 10 ends. Maybe episode 13, 14, I don't know. Anyway, that's all I have for this video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And as always, don't be shy. Hit that like and subscribe. I'm not going anywhere. I make one to two Walking Dead videos per day. So please hit that subscribe button. Right now we are at 774 subscribers. My goal is to try to get to 800 in the next few months. So just remember, every subscriber counts. Every bit of support matters and is very, very appreciated. Hopefully we can get to that goal of 800. Anyway, with all that said, I'm Spencer Rhodes, and I will see you guys later. Bye.